voiceover commentary one more time. Ladies and gentlemen, this is Pro Wrestling's favorite hashtag Rockstar Revolution, Ray Ray Mars, who is one step closer to becoming EHW heavyweight champion after tonight, by the way, pinning the great Bukaki, but this isn't about me. This is about smooth stiff one-on-one competition here at EHW. Folks. From the pit of the room, weighing in at 400 pounds, firm to first call. As you can tell by this man's entrance, he is obviously a very eerie individual. And I don't know if David Adams said this was a tournament matchup. If it is, I would be very afraid to have to draw this man in round two, providing he can defeat whoever he's going up against. And providing this is a tournament matchup. I really, I just got to the camera, I'm not entirely sure. It is a wrestling match though, I can tell you that much. Oh yeah, daddy. Hometown hero. As a bringing his way to the world from the East to the East, the I'm new to this camera thing. If I could zoom, if I knew how to zoom in, I would too. But ladies and gentlemen, the Jaded Angel, Raven Blades. Good friend of Ray Ray Mars's. I've done battle with Raven Blades. I can tell you he is one tough customer. And uh, this bad gentleman does have a lot to worry about. So I'm about to be joined uh, by David Adams one more time. All uh, right, we're missing something in the ring though. It has zebra stripes. That's very true. I don't know who the ref is. I just expected one to show up. I, I'm sure it'll happen the way this show has been today. Oh, we got a ref. It's Showtime Sean Sheridan. Or as I like to call him. Wait, I'll wait till the music dies so I know that I'm being heard. Cletus Gambino, ladies and gentlemen. Ladies and gentlemen, this Turn is in. Cletus Gambino sighting. He's got something to say. Change of plans on the referee situation. Oh, jeez. Oh, I wanted to see Sheridan ref. Uh, I'm your referee. This is almost going to make it impossible. This is not good. This is not bode well for the chances. Ladies and gentlemen, you are referee the EHW National Champion, Cletus. This is going to be impossible. These guys hate each other. He screwed Draven Blaze out of that national championship. That's very true. So, and who who authorized this referee switch? That's what I want to know, David Adams. Oh, I, I, I just work here. It's beyond my pay grade, I, honestly. I, I gotcha. Joining me is hashtag professional wrestling's rockstar revolution, your boy Double R, Ray Ray Mars. That's right. Now, this guy, Vander Vesco, this guy is a lunatic. He was staring me down in the ring. I, saw I couldn't get out of there fast enough. Ooh. This guy is 400 pounds. Oh, you know Draven ain't going to be afraid to take it right to him. but You, you know, know who else came from a boiler room? Freddy Krueger. And he scares the crap out of me just as much. That's very true. It's factually correct. <laughs> Vander Vesco swings him off the ropes. What a vicious clothesline. Vander Vesco just on the chest of Draven Blaze right now, folks. And Draven having a tough time breathing, quite obviously, in that yeah, situation. Yeah, honestly. And right now, Vander Vesco is beating him up. And I, I mean, I want to know when a pinfall happens. Is it going to be a fair one, two, three? Or is it going to be a quick count? Well, in the case of Vander Vesco, it's most definitely going to be a quick count. And I can tell you that. In retrospect, will Cletus Gambino count for, uh, for Draven Blaze if the tides are turned? That's what I want to know. Ooh. Well, wow, that chop. That's a chop. That'll invert boobies real quick. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, God. And that's not a good thing. I said boobies. It's a family show. It's okay. It, you can say boobies, all right, on family shows? I, I, I just did. Well, they I didn't censor it. me. I said it. Oh, it either. snap suplex by the 400-pound Vesco. Ring-shaking suplex, David Adams. That's a ring-breaking suplex, absolutely. Indeed. Oh, he's just shoving Draven to the outside with that big foot. 
So for those of you just tuning in, this is Extreme Hybrid Wrestling's St. Paddy's Day Massacre show in front of a capacity standing room only crowd here at the Simon Kramer Institute in New Philadelphia, Pennsylvania. about to hit the road back home to Jersey after this match. Wanted to come out, see Draven Blaze do his thing, but... Oh, look out. Oh, yes, and congratulations to you, sir. Victorious tonight. You... That's right. Thank you. One step closer to becoming that first ever EHW champion. You're, you're that confident, huh? I like that. I like that. This, is a, this doesn't happen to be a tournament match, does it? This is not a tournament match. Gotcha. I was, gonna say, I would be, I was saying before, I'd be very afraid if it was to have to be a guy who would draw a guy like Van Der Vesco in the second round. Yeah, there's only so many spots available. That's true. Van Dravesco wanted to show us what he's got. We let him know this isn't going to be a tournament match. He's like, he basically just looked at us and said, I don't care. I feel like there's a lot of grunting involved in his response, if I had to guess. Yeah. He is quite the grunter. Yeah. Well, who's going to tell him not to, you know what I'm saying? Not me. That's why I'm behind the camera, and I guess that's why you're behind the camera too Absolutely. right now. Absolutely. I, I spent a minute in the ring. Oh, he's showing off the uh, pecs of the Jaded Angel, Draven Blaze. Involuntarily. And again, it's an involuntary shortage of breathing on the part of Draven Blaze at the hands of this Van Der Vesco character. This guy is legit. Absolutely. He looks to be every bit as big as the Mastodon we saw earlier, Indeed. who did advance in the title tournament. You gotta be wary. Oh, wow. wow. I'm trying not to think about the possibility of having to face him in the next round, to be completely honest, watching Draven Blaze do his thing and take it to this Van Der Vesco, unfazed by that kick. Oh, again! That, that, that one got him. Roundhouse kick and a beauty. The Jaded Angel, Draven Blaze, builds momentum here in this non-tournament match here at St. Paddy's Day Massacre. Ooh. Snap DDT right into the canvas and a beauty. So far, the national champion, Cletus Gambino, just looks on, but he hates Draven Blaze. Remember that. He hates sure. this man. Uh-oh. Oh, here we go. To the high rank district, we know the Jaded Angel likes to fly. Well, he's pretty far away, too. Look out. Wow. Beautiful swanton. Wow. But he missed the mark. I, I apologize. I thought he made it. I thought he hit him. But, man, the 400-pound Vander Vesco moving out of the way. He had good form on the, the swanton, though. We'll give him that. It didn't end very well for him. He didn't, he didn't miss by much. It was close, but close only counts. You win how that goes. Yeah, I don't blame Draven for trying to go up top. I guess a guy this big, you're going to have to take to the air. He's in a precarious spot right now. He doesn't want to be here. Oh, what a vicious thundering slam to the mat. This could be it. Oh! Surprisingly, a normal cadence there from Cletus Gambino on the count. Didn't expect, didn't expect that. Seriously, yeah. I mean, I guess he I guess he figured, why do a fast count? He assumed the match was going to be over. Probably. I mean, after a move like that, you know, you don't, you don't have to think. It could be at or near the end. Raven's got to do something here. The Jaded Angel Draven Blaze in a lot of trouble. And he, he doesn't see this coming. Oh, my God. He just clubbed the head right off the shoulders, pretty much, of the Jaded Angel Draven Blaze. He's almost literally inside out. More figuratively than literally, but you know what I mean. Viewers at home. That's a very, I'll tell you what, that's... That's a really confident cover. Right? When you're 400 pounds and look like that guy, though, a confidence, I think, is allowed. I mean, cockiness... Uh -huh. He should have covered him with it by hooking the leg, but are you going to tell him to hook the leg? No, I'm not. not. But again, like you said, against the guy with the, the credential of Draven Blaze, you've got to make sure you don't give him, like I said before, any breathing room, any chance that he gets to take advantage of a, a lackadaisical cover. He'll do. He'll take advantage. Oh, look out, though. Beautiful suplex by the big man. Just tossed with ease. For the cover. Once again, a fair, a fair count from the national champion, Cletus Gambino. Only a two count. He didn't, he didn't think, try and fast count it. I think Vesco might have pulled Draven up. Actually, might, have, might want to administer a little bit more legal punishment. Ooh. Oh, that's got to be it. You know what? I don't think he got all oh of that splash. Oh he my didn't, God! He didn't get quite as airborne as he wanted to. Draven, please. This guy is working in overtime right now. What's keeping this guy going? Craziness. And again, just because this match is not a tournament matchup, it doesn't mean that these guys aren't going to give 110% in front of this capacity match standing room only crowd to try to get the win, the W. All no doubt about it. That's what it's all about. Oh, took too much time. There we go. Matt and Draven Blaze combination coming. Wow! Boot right to the grill. 
Is he going to go for the cover? He, he pulls him to, to, to the middle. Uh-oh, Drake Javon Blaze is going to the high rank district. Somebody's feeling amphibious. Again, Froggy, let's see. Is he going to cover him? And will Cletus count him? There it is. One. Do the right thing. Two. That, yep, that was a slow count. Slower than the counts for Vesco. Absolutely. The counts for Vesco were fair. That wasn't fair. Cletus is giving him advice. Oh, wow. And the plot thickens. Dun, dun, dun. Loading it up. Nope, nope. Swing. Oh, jeez. Oh, come on. Oh, no. Oh! He hits Vesco! He got all. Oh. Oh, oh super oh. kick! Super push. kick! Oh, wait. One, two, three, yeah. got him! Oh, very nice, very nice. Ladies and gentlemen, here is the winner! Heavyweight Championship Tournament. Jamin Blaze wins! Jamin Blaze wins!